A Central Arkansas competitive go-kart racer had all his equipment stolen. He has a race this weekend. He's going to have to forfeit now. Thanks for joining us at 6. I'm Ashley Katz. Well, good evening. I'm Bob Clawson. Caregiver Stephanie Sharp caught up with him today. And Steph, several thousand dollars taken from this person, obviously by someone who does not belong to him. That's exactly right, Bob and Ashley. Not only was his go-kart taken that you see right here, but his trailer with all of his equi equipment inside was taken as well. He says everything totals to be about $20,000. Having the need for speed. What Hector Hernandez does for fun. He races go-karts in Central Arkansas. Uh, I used to race uh, drag racing back in the days. And then I now I started doing dirt, dirt tracks, and I love it. He's worked hard for years to fund his hobby. That's why he was wrecked when he noticed someone stole his trailer with his go-kart inside. Everything was in there. My fire suit, my jackets, and everything. He filed a report with Bitten Police. He says sometime over the weekend, someone broke the lock to his trailer, picked it up, and left. Uh, right beside the house, that would always park. He doesn't know who took it, but believes they jumped on the nearby interstate. It's been almost a week, so they already put it up and maybe sell, sell some of it. He says he's saved for a while to buy what he had. All my hard work that I did for almost two years and put so much into it, and it's just now gone, so... That's the, that's the worst part of it, you know. This ordeal is just a pit stop for Hernandez. His friends plan to loan him new equipment. Probably in two, three weeks, I'll be able to get back into the track. And he was supposed to race this weekend in Moralton, and he's having to forfeit that race, but he hopes to get back on it soon. If you see a car like this or anything that looks like this, you're asked to call Bitten Police. Back to you.